Hi everyone, today we're going to do long division and we're going to be using number disc to show our long division. So I have 431 here. I'm going to go ahead and write it into my long division grid. 431. And I'm going to be sharing, I'm going to be dividing equally 431 into three groups, which I have put here, three plates. This is like my three groups. So I'm going to write it three. So I always start with the greatest place value, which is the hundreds place. Now I have four hundreds here. And if I have four divided by three, I can actually give them each a hundred. Yep. So I gave them a hundred each. Now in the hundreds place, one hundred each, I would have used up three hundreds. So one times three, I used up three groups of one hundred, three. I'm going to subtract to check how many hundreds I have left. Yep, and I have 100 that I did not share. Now I'm going to regroup these hundreds into tens. Now 100 equals to 10 tens. I have 10 tens here, yes? Now 10 tens plus the 3 tens that I did not use that will give me 13 tens. Now let's work with the tens. I have 13 tens. 13 divided by 3, I can actually give them, now if you do not know, you can skip count in 3. If I give a 10 to each, I will use up 3 tens. If I give out 2 tens, I will use up 6 tens. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. And I stop because now 15 is more than I can give. I only have 13 tens, so I can only give out 12 tens. So, 12 is 3 times 4, meaning I have 3 groups and I'm going to give them each 4 pieces. So, I'm going to give them 4 tens. And here, and another 4 tens here, and another 4 tens there. Okay, so if I give them 4 each, I'm going to write 4 in the tens place. I would have used up 4 times 3, I would have used up 12 tens. Now, I'm going to subtract to check how many tens I have left. I have one ten left. Now, I'm going to put the tens with the ones, and I need to regroup ten into ones. So, one ten equals to ten ones. So, how many ones do I have now? Ten ones plus the one one that I had not shared. So, I'm going to have eleven ones. Now, 11, and I'm going to share by 3. I can give out 9, meaning I'm going to give each of them 3 ones, 3 ones, and 3 ones. Ugh. Yes, if I give them each 3 ones, I would have used up 9 pieces. Yep, 3 times 3 is 9. And so I have 2 ones left. Here we go. So what does our quotient and 143 means? It means that if I have 431, I share with 3 friends. Each friend gets 143, 143, and 143. And I have a remainder of 2 ones. Here. Yeah. R2. To check, I have to add it all back up to see that it adds up to 431. So you can either do addition, 143 plus 143 plus 143 plus 2, or you can multiply 143 times 3 and then add the 2 remainder to get back 431. I hope you understand. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comment section.